my youtubers how you doing i missed you oh my goodness this is your girl treasure and today we are going platinum like okay i know i've been on this blonde kick lately but this is blonde yes um this wig is the millie wig in the color 20 op 2713 is by free trust and i thought i have a box here oh sorry Sorry guys, here's the box. <laughs> okay, this is the Deep Invisible Part by Equal. Um, this is the Millie Style, and this is Curling Iron Safe. Um, this is the color I got, OP61327, and um, it does have a root. It doesn't say the root color, just says the blonde color, but there is a root as you can see. I got this wig from um what's the site blackhairspray.com because i went on to beautyshoppers.com where i got my bentley wig and they were sold out in this color my local bee supply was also sold out in this color so this color must be very popular i'm thinking maybe it might be because you know when celebrities start doing trends that's when everybody want to get on it so you know Nicki Minaj has been wearing her hair like this lately with the root and the platinum blonde. So maybe that's why. Or maybe people just, you know, summertime people want to be cute. And I can't blame them because I like this wig on me. <laughs> yes. So, yes. Um, let's talk about this wig, y'all. This is synthetic hair. I don't think it's Futura fiber. I'm not sure. Let me see. I don't say it on here that's Futura. But um, it has the deep part. Here we go. And um, it said it's a pre-cut wig. The, there's no lace to cut off. And it's not. It comes just like this. There's no lace to cut off. But um, the hairline is very blunt. And the um, root color is actually looks like a color 2. Maybe even a 4. It's definitely not a 1B. Because you see my real hair is black. So it um, doesn't blend too well, unfortunately. But um, what I plan on doing is going over the roots with a black Sharpie. And I think that will make it look a little better. Like if my hair is sticking out, it won't be so noticeable that the colors are different. Um, this wig came to, I believe it was like $35 with shipping. Um, it was really cheap. Got to my house in a day. Um, I ordered it like one o'clock in the morning and then I, on a Tuesday, I think I got it on a Thursday. So, shit really quickly. Um, that was my first time order from Black Hairspray. I hear a lot of people talking about them and I recommend them. I mean, it came quickly. It was weird because one of the shipping was like $4 and the other one was like $27, but it was for like the same date arrival. So I'm like, uh, $4, what are you talking about? <laughs> Why would I pay $27 if I don't have to? So, um, let me show you the length. The look, it looks like 16, maybe 18, and it does have some pre cut layers in it, as you can see. Um, I'm wearing it to the left side, but you can wear it anywhere you want to wear. You can wear it to the front, I think it's cute like that, too. See, I like the front, too, and um, but I usually wear mine on the left, that's just me, but um. I like this wig a lot, but I think what I'm going to do is straighten it. I just have this idea that it's going to look really cute straight. So I'm going to straighten it, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. So I just got finished straightening the Millie wig. And as you can see, it took, but I'm telling you guys, it took a long time to straighten it. I think because the wig company manufactured to be curly, it wasn't meant to lose its curl pattern right away. Therefore, it was um, kind of difficult to straighten it. I had to actually put my heat... Um, What's it called? The flat iron up to 400 degrees, like all the way up, just to get it straight like this. So yeah, um, also added some foundation apart. 
and I did color the roots black with a black sharpie like I said I was going to do. Um, I, I did a rush job so it's not really all that straight in the back I know but you know straight enough to get the result I wanted so um, you can wear a Millie straight you can wear a curly however you like Millie that is up to you so hopefully you will get Millie if you like her I like her I think she's a really nice blonde wig and um very pale blonde like this is supposed to be a 27 613 mix but I'm telling you it's way more 613 than it is 27 27 is more like a honey blonde this is definitely like teeter on the side of platinum blonde if not just straight up platinum um I did see some honey pieces in there as I was flat ironing I said okay I see 27 but really it's really light excuse me it's really light so if you're not comfortable with that you know maybe you don't want Millie in this color but just want you to know that it's really light so I hope you like this wig and I will see you guys but I will see you guys soon and uh, if you have any questions as always hit me up let me know and I will get back to you bye bye